Hello, I'm Viola Malone, President and CEO of The Bag Lady, Inc. The Bag Lady, Inc.'s mission is to manufacture, distribute, and support the world's fastest portable and fully automatic ergonomic sandbagging machine. We are dedicated to reduce injury while increasing production and supply our customers with ongoing client satisfaction. State-of-the-art technologies, innovative business strategies, behind the scenes, insights from cutting-edge users around the globe on World Business Review. Welcome to World Business Review. I'm Norman Schwarzkopf. Sandbags are a simple and effective way to prevent or reduce flood water damage to private property and commercial buildings. Properly filled and placed, sandbags can also help to divert dangerous fast-moving water and possibly reduce the loss of life. But filling them is a time-consuming and labor-intensive process. Here to discuss this is Viola Malone, President and CEO of The Bag Lady Incorporated. Welcome to World Business Review, Viola. Thank you. It's a real honor to be here. You know, Viola, when I was an empty man, I filled a lot of sandbags by hand. It was a back-breaking job. You have developed a machine that eliminates that. Well, actually, my husband, Morris Malone, developed the machine. And it's not every lucky housewife that has a husband develop a bagging machine just for them. So I started a business called The Bag Lady, Inc. And I sold empty and filled sandbags. And eventually, after about five or six years, some municipalities got interested in how we filled our sandbags and talked us into going into the manufacturing business. And now we have machines all over the world. How does your automatic bagging machine solution help first responders? Well, we really eliminate the need for a large staging area, uh, for a large amount of volunteers. With just a handful of people, we can fill thousands of bags an hour. And this frees up the volunteers to be placing the bags rather than spending time filling them. Amazing. For more, let's go to this World Business Review field report. During emergency situations or in times of natural disasters, we immediately think about using sandbags to redirect or stave off rising water. The Bag Lady's Mega Bagger takes the workload of many men and reduces it to a manageable effort. Our firm has been active in the erosion and sediment control business in Southern California since 1976. We chose the Mega Bagger because of its superior design and engineering features which allow it to perform in less than ideal weather and material conditions. These self-contained portable sandbagging machines come with a heavy-duty Martin Engineering adjustable vibrator to keep materials flowing. When using the Mega Bagger uh, producing sandbags, we've realized a labor savings of up to 80 percent and a 400 percent increase in production. Heavy rains cause major flooding in many areas of Washington State. Working in conjunction with several county emergency management departments, over 10,000 filled sandbags were supplied in only two days. We're currently using the single station mega bagger. All of our bags are filled with one quarter to three quarter inch rock. They're used primarily for desilting stormwater, filtering the stormwater as it leaves the construction sites. Today, each mega bagger is still built by hand. Each unit is ergonomically designed for ease of use while producing maximum capabilities and with an eye on safety. For World Business Review, I'm Michael Clark reporting. Viola, how long did it take you to develop a prototype? Well, actually, my husband developed the prototype and it took a few months as he had to work to support the family and he could only work on it at nights and on the weekends. Who uses your machines? Well, now we have military, municipalities, private contractors that are in the erosion control business, and ourselves. Did you sell any machines during the Katrina hurricane? No, I am sorry to say I did not. It's all too often that municipalities, due to bureaucratic red tape, are not able to get the money before the disaster strikes to purchase this equipment. You really have to plan ahead and have this beforehand. But what I'm really excited to bring to you today 
is our new mini bagger which turns any sanding truck into an automatic bagging machine. For a mere charge on your credit card, you can have one of these machines shipped overnight. Why should people purchase your automatic bagging machines when usually there are hundreds of volunteers willing to do this work? Well, because we can eliminate uh, all of the hours that it takes to fill the sandbags. We can put those volunteers right to work placing the bags. We can fill a bag every three seconds, resulting in thousands of bags an hour. Oh, goodness. Viola, uh, tell us about the manufacturing process of sandbagging machines. We have a small manufacturing plant. We manufacture each machine by hand. We oversee all of the components. We are able to provide better customer satisfaction by not mass producing our equipment. Well, how fast can your machines dig a sandbag? Well, actually, there was a test done with me on video where I filled 27 filled sandbags in 54 seconds. That relates to over 1,800 bags an hour. Now, I can't keep that up for an hour, but on the average, on a single station machine, we fill at least 1,000 bags an hour. On a double station machine, it's 2,000 bags an hour. That's phenomenal. Can anyone operate an automatic bagging machine? Yes, they can. Uh, we've had women, men. Uh, I've even had people with back problems able to fill sandbags. You can stand upright due to our ergonomics in the machine. There isn't any lifting or twisting. Uh, of course, I don't recommend children out around any heavy equipment, but our machines are designed for anyone to fill bags in seconds. What kind of additional equipment is required for your solution? That's one of the nice things about uh, the Mega Baggers. If you have one of our trailer mounted or skid mounted machines, the only extra equipment you need is a loader. Whereas my new sanding uh, truck attachment, you obviously need a sanding truck. Have you made any design improvements since you rolled out your first machine? Yes, we have. Since I'm a user of the, the Mega Bagger, we were able to uh, make designs on the fly. Uh, you know, we've probably gone through about five or six different designs. We've tried augers, uh, bi-directional augers. We found they drill holes in wet sand. So we found that steep angles and properly placed vibrators is the best way to flow wet sand. And how do you control the automation on these machines? We have potentiometers on our control panels, which are dials, and you're able to dial how fast you want to fill a bag, or even the size of the bag you want filled. Well, what do you do if someone can't keep up? <laughs> well, that could be a problem, but not with a mega bagger. We have uh, the dial that can turn the machine down, or you can flip it to manual operation, where you will get a bag only when you push a button. That triggers the machine to come on, fill your bag, and then it sits and waits for you until you're ready, then you just push the button, and you'll get another bag. Okay, then how do you control how much material goes into the bag? That's back to the potentiometer. That, uh, our machines run on time rather than weight. So depending on how long you left the chute open, that will be determining the size of your bag. And what's meant by portable? Our machines are readily towable if you purchase one that is an integrated trailer mounted machine. You just hook up with your vehicle, truck, and tow it. Or on our skid mounted machines, we have built in tubing for forklift, easily picked up. Will your machine work in the rain with wet sand? Well, that's a funny question, seeing as how I'm from Washington with webbed feet. Uh, yes, our machines work very well with wet sand. I should know that since I've had to carry some of those sandbags <laughs> around. Other than filling sandbags, what are some of the other uses for the Mega Bagger? Well, we've had some municipalities that use them in their landfills for filling composting bags. We have gravel pits that use them for filling different kinds of aggregates. Uh, some companies use them for filling sawdust. There's many different uses for a Mega Bagger. So it works in other things besides just sand? Yes, it does. That's why I didn't call it a sand bagging machine. It's a Mega Bagger. Well, thank you very much for being here. Take it from one who has had to fill a lot of sandbags, <laughs> most of them with wet sand. That's really a very, very interesting report, and we appreciate it. Well, thank you. And thank you for watching. Until next time for World Business Review, I'm Norman Schwarzkopf.